Love, destiny, and choices. When two people come together, they take a journey. Britt and Matthew know that this journey wasn't done alone, which is why they have asked each of us to be here and to help them as they mark their transition to husband and wife. Matthew and Britt are so loved and they are cared for by us, their family and friends. And at times, they do lean on us as family should. It is our care and support of them that creates this temple which they believe is essential for this day and all of the days ahead of them. It is through our shared time together as family and as friends which makes our collective one big family. And as family, we wish for them to experience a life together which is filled with joy and contentment, a marriage filled with love beyond measure. Britt and Matthew, we are your temple. We are unconditional love for the days and the years that you have ahead of you. So about this day. This day is definitely about love. So everyone should just prepare themselves for an overload of love. <laughs> Britt and Matthew see this day and how it was paved by destiny and choices. At the very core of this day is their belief in one another and the lesson that they are better off for all that they have let into their hearts. And this day arrived because patience and love did prevail over all obstacles. Now, destiny and choices. <laughs> this sounds like a solid debate waiting to happen over a family bonfire. <laughs> or in this family, while we eat appetizers or carve the turkey. <laughs> because what family doesn't need a really good debate to test the waters of unconditional love? But it has been said that choices are the hinges of destiny. Should we choose intuition or, or maybe a life lesson to guide us and we go down a path, we go in a direction. Now avoid making a choice and life will indeed move forward and one finds themselves moving in a direction just the same. We make choices. And those decisions bring to us these defining moments in our lives. Those defining moments actually then can swing Destiny's door wide open. Matthew Russell Kramer, my love, my almost husband, and my one and only PIC. Today and always, I vow to trust you and respect you as your own person. To remember that your interests, desires, and needs are lo no less important than mine. I vow to be honest and transparent with you and to continue to work on being patient and understanding. I vow to always encourage us to experience new things and explore new places. I vow to love you when it's easy, when it's hard, when our love is simple, and when it takes great effort. But most of all, I vow to be worth it worth the time, worth the adventure, worth the energy, and even the frustrations. I promise to be worth your love, that you will always count, and that for me, you will always come first for the rest of our days. Brittany Nicole Hughes. I love you unconditionally and without hesitation. I vow to love you, encourage you, trust you, and respect you. I promise to love you when it's easy and even more when it is hard. I promise to work with you to create a magnificent life together. I promise to not only grow old with you, but grow with you. From this day forward, I choose you to be my wife. I accept you as you are and offer myself in return. 
I will care for you, stand beside you, and share with you all of life's adversities and all of its joys from this day forward and all the days of my life. By the power invested in me by the Universal Church in the state of Michigan, I here now pronounce you husband and wife. Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you for the first time, Mr. and Mrs. Matthew Kramer.